stores across the country are now hosting Hostess brands, even right now here in Kansas City. Hostess executives opened the doors to a bakery near Chicago today, giving reporters a peek at production. The bakeries went belly up last year when Hostess managers couldn't reach a deal with union workers, and the brands were sold off. The president of Hostess asked for patience and goodwill. Please, please, don't storm your local retailers. Don't accost store managers. And most important, we don't want to see any fights over the last package of Twinkie on the shelf. We will be there shortly. Now here in Kansas City, we found plenty of Twinkies for sale, but they might not look exactly like you remember. Shannon Halligan is live at the High V in Blue Springs to tell us how shoppers in the city are benefiting. Well, today is the first day that you can get these cream-filled classics once again, but not all stores in the area have received their shipment yet. This high V in Blue Springs was able to get their shipment, but many other grocery stores won't get theirs until later in the week. Now, Kansas City-based advertising agency Bernstein Rain is responsible for the promotion of the company and its sweetest comeback in the history of ever, so they say. And another local company helped put together this new billboard off of I-35 in Kansas City. Still, the company has had to cut down since filing for bankruptcy. Only about 25% of the previous 18,000 jobs will return. But some can't help but be excited about their favorite treat. Because all my family eats Twinkies. I have five kids. They live off of Twinkies. They go for lunch. They go for dessert. They go for snacks. So I was sad, but now that they're back, we're very excited. And on 41 Action News at 5, find out why these treats may look the same, but there are some big changes. Live in Blue Springs, Shannon Halligan, 41 Action News.